Hi hey guys, Andre from Conveyor Randomness here and today I'll be looking at this, the Logitech K380 wireless keyboard. This is the K380 multi-device Bluetooth keyboard from Logitech. A nice modern take on the old classic keyboard that we're all familiar with from yesteryear. In a world where more of us have the on the move and always portable mentality when it comes to our tech, there needs to be accessories that are able to accommodate and involve with those transitions. And this keyboard is just one of those products that are doing just that. Available in rose, off-white, graphite, and this one blue, and in different languages and keyboard layout regions, the K380 keyboard features Bluetooth connectivity for up to three devices, all conveniently controlled by pressing alternate buttons of the one, two, and three Bluetooth keys on the top row of the keyboard, which are easily distinguishable from the other keys. Seamless compatibility with all Bluetooth wireless devices with external keyboard support. The K380 can be used on devices using Windows, Mac OS, iPad OS, iOS, Chrome OS, Android, Apple TV, and even your PlayStation 4 operating systems. All of these different compatible devices means that you can use one keyboard for three devices on any of those systems, and you're not even tied down to using familiar systems either. I use this keyboard on my Mac Mini, iPad, and PlayStation 4. Multi-device support to your smartphone, computer, laptop, tablet, TV, or your console within the 10 meter radius, all by simply initially pairing two by holding down the one, two, or three Bluetooth keys on the keyboard, depending on your preference, and connecting to it like you would with any other Bluetooth compatible device. Find in the list of available devices, press pair and you're done. Once connected, all you will need to do in the future to easily and almost instantly connect to your device is press the appropriate Bluetooth key and connection to your device is done and confirmed by the light above the key selection. How easy and simple is that? And once you're finished with the keyboard, just switch it off at the side and store it away. With different operating systems come slightly different keyboard layouts like between Mac OS, iOS and Windows and Android. If you have different map keys and shortcuts on your different connected operating systems, keyboard will automatically change these depending on your operating system, while at the same time you're also able to manually change these. Looking almost like a keyboard that has been lifted straight from a laptop, the K380 provides a really comfortable typing experience with its convex shaped control function navigation spacebar keys and concave alphanumerical typing keys that give an almost natural feel to gliding across the keyboard and pressing those circularly shaped buttons effortlessly. With its slightly sloped design, your wrist position should remain comfortable for hours of continuous typing should your workload demand that, while at the same time remaining quiet, not adding that familiar clattering and depressed keyboard keys. And the rubber pads at the bottom of the keyboard mean that you should be able to use this on almost any surface. Going from a keyboard with more squared off closely positioned keys, the transition to those circular buttons was fine, and now I'm comfortable with it feeling so smooth and effortless even for a not so quick typer like myself. Battery powered and with a Logitech claimed two year battery life, the K380 should leave you not wanting to have to worry about a depleting battery for a long time. Its lack of backlighting, including cap locks indicator and low power mode certainly help this. The good thing about the claimed long battery life over something that is USB cable charge is that with a dying battery you could spend many times over that two year period worrying over the battery life of your keyboard if you had to charge it via USB. Plus it removes some of that portability away. Imagine if you're sitting at a cafe with your iPad, you pull out your keyboard and have to find a plug to charge it. All that worry removed of long battery life, unless you're coming to the end of the battery life of course. It's quite a deceptively weighty keyboard for something this small when you first take it out of the box compared to other more budget friendly options, but that plastic build quality certainly does give it its charm and a high quality feel that could easily be used on your lap, on a table at home or even put it away in a bag and use it while you're out or travelling. I mentioned earlier that it feels like a keyboard lifted directly from a laptop. That's exactly what it feels like using and typing on this keyboard. If you prefer long typing sessions and you are familiar and prefer using a mechanical keyboard, then this probably wouldn't be the keyboard that you would enjoy using. But for use on the go and out and about, then it's perfect. If you mainly use smaller, more portable devices at home and a large full-size keyboard wouldn't fit the aesthetic that you're going for, then something like this could be worth a go. And in the four available colours, I'm sure you'll find something that fits the colour theme. Why not combine and complement its use with the Logitech Pebble Mouse, like I did? If you choose to get them both, matching colours would be better. If you want to see my review on the Logitech Pebble, follow the link up there.
If you're using the keyboard on a Mac or PC, you can slightly enhance your monitor experience with the K380 keyboard by installing Logitech Options, which with the K380 offers notification and status updates, easy switch status inform you of which devices are currently paired to the keyboard's three Bluetooth channels, access to Logitech Flow, which allows you to transfer files, text and images if you're using two or three computers at the same time by copying on one and pasting on another. And if you are using a Windows PC, F key customization. Logitech Options is not a necessity to download, but some people may find it useful to use. With other more advanced Logitech mice and keyboard, you may find there are a few more additional customizable actions for the device. Available at a price probably just above the budget market price, but still, for me, it feels like an inexpensive purchase that will provide you value for money. I'll leave the Amazon link to the keyboard in the description below. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon to get notified every time I release a new video. That's all for me today. I'll see you on the next one. <laughs> Bye. Why don't you watch one of the two videos below? Or both if you want. Click before the time runs out. Three, two, one.